Howdy everybody, this is Brian, Indiana Creek Gold. Uh, it's been a while since we've done any of these, but I figured we would put out a little batch of lotto bags. Uh, most of you all know what these are all about. They have a little bit of everything in them. Uh, this is just like playing the lotto, but this uh, you cannot lose on this one. So, uh, I said all of these bags, there's 10 bags here, and we'll fill them up as much as we can with material. Each one of these bags are going to have at least a tenth of a gram of gold in them. And uh, there's probably an ounce of silver there, close to it. Uh, probably about the same there. Uh, that is going to get spread throughout those bags. Uh, actually, let me pause this. Let's grab the scales. Let's look at this stuff. All right, here's our silver shot. Oh, I was way off. There is 21 grams there. 21 grams so uh, tear that again. One seven. All right, y'all get the gist of this. Uh, we'll do two grams in each one of these, and uh, let's see what we got left over. All right, I got around two tenths or a little over of silver shot. Well, let's see. Tear that out. How much of this Vendetta silver we have? This is a Vendetta crystalline silver. Awesome, awesome, awesome stuff. Again, I was quite a bit off on the weight. About the same on the silver shot, at least I guess the same. So, uh, yeah. We'll do a couple tenths of Vendetta Silver in each one of those. All right, each bag has right at two tenths, or just a hair over. That leaves 2.21 grams that we'll randomly add to a, a bag there in the middle. Okay, and uh, as with these lotto bags, I said you never know what combination you are going to get. So, uh, we always add some coins, and we got some good ones on this one. But first off, I want to show you all this stuff. This is stuff I have saved along the way. All of this has come down from the creek here up the road. Uh, some nice garnets in there. Bunches of pieces of quartz. I do believe there's an Indiana diamond. Uh, like a real diamond, maybe. Right there. Possibly. Uh, said mussel shells. These little bunches of these little bitty cool freshwater snail shells uh, you know, I said garnets bigger chunks of garnets just some cool stuff in general but lots of those little bitty uh, snail shells so we're gonna divvy this stuff up in there and I need to put it in 
something a little better though. I believe. Hmm. All right, hold on for a second. All right. Let me just sprinkle, sprinkle, sprinkle. Spread some coolness around there. All right. Now, what we're going to do. Yeah, mess. Is, uh. Got some copper nuggets here. One. an extra one okay now we have uh, these uh, let's get scaled out again all right we are teared out uh, little chunker number one is right at one tenth of a gram and we're gonna put it Right there in that bag. Okay. Leave it just the way it is. Uh, chunker number two. Point two one grams. I am going to turn them to so I know which is which. Alright. It's a little one. 0.06. So a nice little crystalline looking piece. And uh, the last one here. 0.09 Alright yeah. I don't know which is which I don't know where anything went now I lost track of that That's how uh, fast I lose track Okay uh, Let me get these mixed up a little bit Alright I'm all zipped up. Next, everything in good. So much gold I brought out here in this deal, Mahiki here. 
Actually, you know what? I'm gonna use this right here. All right. So, uh, everybody basically gets a tenth, uh, give or take a hundredth or so, or a thousandth or what, a hundredth, I guess. But, uh, I'm going to try real close to get close to a tenth on everybody. So, uh, we'll get this gold in there and be back. All right. I had to go in and get a little bit of gold, uh, to make a tenth happen in that last one. But there we are. Uh, it is in there, and now to the coin part. Right here is our selection. A beautiful proof quarter. My phone is not wanting to focus, but uh, silver proof. Two thousand eighteen Georgia. Uh, let's just go through these here. Got that. I don't know. I'd say that may be silver, or at least uh, partially silver. Uh, got a Roman coin. We have a Merc. 1945 Mercury Dime. That's actually in pretty good shape. We have a couple euros here. Uh, we have a barber dime, a 1912 barber dime. We have a Liberty quarter. That is a standing Liberty, I do believe, quarter, maybe. Uh, 1928. We have, this is really, really, really cool coin from uh, Portugal. What is that? What's that say? Portuguese. Uh, yeah. Portuguese. Cool. Uh, and then the big score, beautiful 1944 Liberty Half Dollar. So, uh, these babies are going in the bags. So, uh, here's how I do that. I put something in there and I'm sticking these to the back so I can't see what they are and I will turn it sideways. That silver proof quarter. Quarter. Cool Portuguese coin. Very cool old Roman coin. Mercury dime going in there. Nineteen twelve barber dime going in that one. Euro and a euro. are nicely seated there and uh, now I'm going to pile in a little more dirt on these uh, I do believe that's all our goodies going in there so uh, at least one of these bags has what three point or point three one uh, another one's got a couple tents 
And then a couple ones got a 0.16 in gold. And uh, plus you got your coins. Uh, I don't know, I think those Liberty halves are worth 15 bucks or so, I would think. Uh, first quarter is probably a five, six dollar quarter. Uh, but I guess uh, I will. I can get these shipped out. I will, I'm going to put all these and go ahead and put them all in a bubble wrap envelope, probably. I think I've got some in there. But if you all are interested, uh, my contact info will be in the description of this video. And uh, it's going to cost between 5 and $6 to ship these, probably. So, uh, I don't know, $26 a bag sound reasonable enough. Uh, that ought to give everybody a, a, a really fun bag and a uh, few people, you know, 100 ROI, 100 plus ROI maybe. If you get uh, hooked up right. But yeah, if y'all are interested, $26 a bag will get these shipped out to you. Uh, let me know. Get with me, contact with me, contact me before you send the money. Cash App, PayPal, uh, Zelle, all that will be in the description. So I uh, don't want to sell you something that I don't have. Y'all take care.